And we know you have been waiting and waiting for this, and the time is just about here. In the next several months, you can expect a much smoother drive on the Red Mountain Expressway. WVTM 13 Ship Scarborough has the updated timeline on the work to repave that busy stretch of road. Well, drivers who use Red Mountain Expressway in Birmingham have sort of gotten used to driving on a not so smooth surface over the last year, but the Alabama Department of Transportation tells me that's all about to change. It's going to make waking up to go to work a lot easier. Virginia Nelson is thrilled to hear that crews plan to start paving Red Mountain Expressway in just a few days. That is music to my ears. It's one of the busiest streets I feel like in Birmingham. I travel to work every single day on it. So to hear that it's being paved is amazing. The Alabama Department of Transportation says resurfacing of the expressway should start on or about May 15. Crews had initially hoped to complete the project before the start of the World Games last July, but fell short. Now we are coming back and the winter caught us, uh, the weather, we couldn't actually put the final surface on it. And the final surface will be an asphalt plant mix and that plant mix will, it will be done at night. And because it's done at night, it's temperature sensitive. Which is the main reason ALDOT says workers had to wait until now to finish the resurfacing when overnight temperatures are more mild. Crews have already installed a new concrete median and added merge lanes between Highland Avenue and 21st Street. Paving is the only thing lacking. And we'll have a brand new surface, smooth for everyone to ride on on Red Mountain Expressway. <laughs> Happy driving. And Al Dot telling me the overall resurfacing project should take about a month. Drivers are urged to use alternate routes or allow extra time if you drive this stretch of road in the overnight hours. Along Red Mountain Expressway in Birmingham, Chip Scarborough, WVTM 13.